got it. What you need? You know I got. All I'm asking is for a little subscribe, baby, just a little bit. Hey, just a little bit. What's up, everybody? Welcome to my YouTube channel. It's your girl, Sky Scandalous, coming at you with the dry 4C curls. So this weekend, I bought a blow-up pool to go in my backyard, and I spent Friday, Saturday, Sunday, all day out in the sun with no protective style. On Friday when I was out, it was beautiful. Curls, blissful, like, mwah. By Sunday, and now it's Monday. And it's time for a wash day. So my heart is still out here in these streets when it comes to hair care products. So I literally bounced around just trying to find like the maximum moisture for my hair because my hair is thirstier than Steve Urkel was for Laura Winslow. So I recently heard about the black owned line Talia Wajid. I believe I'm saying that right. Talia Wajid. I think I am. I think I'm saying that right. Went to my nearest beauty supply. I picked up a deep conditioner as well as a curl definer. Both of these products cost me $9.99 which in my natural hair care product that's pretty cheap okay it's pretty affordable so I'm gonna start washing my hair then I use a conditioner by Ozzy and I'm gonna follow it up with this Talia Waji deep conditioner and then put a little curl definer in and I think I'm gonna do some Bantu knots today so let's get into it I'm back fresh out the shower my hair is washed and just basic condition not deep condition I am using the Talia Wajid green apple and aloe with coconut apple cider deep conditioner <sighs> I specifically chose this conditioner because it has the apple cider vinegar in it and I actually use apple cider vinegar. I use it as like a pre-wash because I have ridiculously bad dandruff and apple cider vinegar truly helps. It doesn't smell as strong as the apple cider vinegar I use straight up, that's for sure. Um, it doesn't really have a significant fragrance to me. I got too excited. I totally forgot to um, section my hair off. I'm just gonna do a little bit. Okay. I see you trying to give me a little bit of hang time. I just like to apply a generous amount and then I'll go through like strand by strand and try to coat as much as I can. I just find it easier to just start out doing it like this. I am nobody's hair guru, just so you guys know. I'm actually still actively learning how to manage my hair, work with my hair, what products work well with my hair, which is why we are on this product trial run right now and I'm definitely seeing some weight makes me feel like the products working I don't know if that's the gag but that's how I feel I'm the worst natural I hate the feeling of like stuff on my hands I literally have to wipe my hands off every freaking time and I know it's bad it's a waste of product and then it's like girl you're just about to put more back on but, but I can't like my brain does not like the way that crap feels Like, why is it so hard to beat shrinkage? I feel like shrinkage is a never-ending battle against your inner demons. <laughs> I'm missing a lot back here, it seems like. So I'm gonna just do... Part. right here oh yeah see felt it it felt dry so I guess that's good I can feel a difference in texture have you ever literally put like a conditioner or any type of moisturizing product on your hair and like it's just felt like nothing was on it if so comment the name of said product below and help other fellow naturals stay away from the products like that but this is definitely not one of those products. I can totally feel a change in the texture of my hair when it's on. It feels softer, more manageable compared to like right here. Like I could tell when I was parting it, it felt dry. I could feel the coarseness. I'm already halfway through this bottle. Am I, am I wasteful? I don't know. Maybe. Maybe not. Maybe my hair just that damn thirsty. Or maybe I am wasteful because I do wash my hands every 30 seconds. Hey guys, so I have applied the deep conditioner all throughout my hair. Um, shrinkage, you a mother, lie. <sighs> Still unbothered. Let's get this show on the road. Can you tell I was a singer in my past life? Cover with plastic caps, sit under dryer for 15 to 20 minutes. Leave on hair 10 minutes longer if not using a dryer. I have a dryer, but I really don't feel like doing all that. So we're just gonna test the product out in its most natural form without heat. To all right. Ow. The fuck? All right. 
like 30 minutes later. Let's see what we got. Oh. My hair drank that up. <laughs> uh, ooh. What? Okay. Okay. Y'all, this feels... Ooh, and oh my God. Look how... And look how... Look how easy my finger just runs through my naps. Let's look. Look at that. Ooh. I like it. It feels good so far. The comb is just gliding through. No catches. Okay. I'm getting a little bit of catching up here, but I mean, girl, I got thick 4C hair. You gonna be pressed <laughs> before uh, all this stuff come out nap free. You get it pressed like I just got my hair pressed. And that's the only way I'm gonna be nap free is if I, I'm sure you got it. When I first hopped on this camera before I did anything, this was, this one, not nah. done with the conditioner. I'm impressed, like it does feel soft. I feel like it could be softer, <laughs> but I, I could just be hella hopeful, so. I'm now about to start using my green apple and aloe nutrition curl definer. Oh, this smells good. This, I can definitely smell the green apple. It smells pleasant. Ooh, ooh this is, this, <laughs> This feels thick and sticky, like glue. You know how you used to put glue on your hands and like do that? Just starting with a little tiny section, see what we get. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. like a gel I mean it's a curl definer so it may have the same properties I don't know but I like how it's making my hair feel because I feel like I'm gonna get the definition as well as the moisture seeing that it's not gel my hair feels very manageable my fingers are like sliding through my curls right now okay you guys this is the final result. Look at this, like look, look at this curl definition right here. This is a good one. I will say my hair definitely is not in the same state that I started this video out with. There is definitely some definition. It does feel soft. It definitely has some weight on it. So I'm going to go ahead and start styling my hair and stay tuned to see my final rating. All right, everyone, it is time for the grand reveal. I did my Bantu knots Monday night, it is Friday. We're gonna just see how my hair is looking underneath all of this. So I am expecting my curls to be tighter than normal due to the fact that I had them knotted up for so long. I'm still just more so trying to see like, how does my hair feel? How defined are the curls? Okay, I think I got them off for real now. So, what's going on right here? Well, what happened to you? Something was misbehaving on Bantu knot day. But just a quick look, this is literally just taking out my Bantu knots. Going through messing with it, my hair still feels soft. It doesn't feel dried out by the products. I'm loving this, you guys. I'm legit. No, you don't understand how much I'm loving this. I'm loving how it feels. I'm loving how it looks. Like, my curls look so cute. Like, can I don't even know if this camera is doing it justice. Like, they just look so cute. And I've done Bantu knots before with other products, like Cantu. I've done my Bantus with Cantu's curl cream. And they did not look this cute. My Bantu knots, like, they held really well. Sometimes when I do Bantu knots, they get frizzy fast. But I mean, I made it to Friday and them things were still looking okay. I'm gonna continue to use the deep conditioner just because I just wanna test it out a few more times before I determine whether or not I wanna try another one. But I think that the curling cream, I think that is my new fave curling cream. Like I, I love, I like this, my hair. I wish you could feel it. My hair feels so damn soft, you guys. 
it feels so soft oh my gosh like, i gotta give the curling cream a 10 because i think that's my new curling cream and it's only ten dollars what and like the ends didn't unravel and become all frizzy looking i still got my definition which is amazing these this product Girl, this is my new curl defining cream. From now on, when y'all see Sky Scandalous and you ask what products I use, Talia was ye green apple with coconut curl defining cream. <laughs> That's what it is. <laughs> That's what it is. I love this. I love it. Well, there you have it. There is my review on Talia Waji. Thanks so much for tuning in. Stay beautiful, stay blessed, and stay positive. Bye, you guys.